God put a, a certain plant here in life for man, for Indians to find. Okay, I, I know you're whatever, you're probably against it, whatever. But um, God put that in purpose for people to have arthritis and the plant on earth for, for uh, medicinal purposes. I think I know where you're going. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And uh, I do. I smoke it once in a while. But you know what? It helps me because I've been, in, I've died nine times from a car accident, hit and run. You Let died nine here. times? Yep. You mean you were you were resuscitated? Yep. That's nine amazing. Times. That must have been a pretty serious accident. Yes, sir, it was. But, you know, it, I believe everybody's got their own belief in the life of that plant. But I believe what God put it to plant on earth for for people like me, or other people that have crippling arthritis, uh, you know, it helps them. Sure, that, that's not a problem. I mean, you know, it, that's all good. But other people shouldn't look bad at it, but they do. But, you know, that's their own beliefs, you know? Now, you did you just see that the Connecticut legislature passed a law allowing uh, marijuana as of medicinal use. Yes. And that's what you're talking about. Yes, sir. Now, I noticed on a show last night that the uh, uh, Indian, um, forgot what they call themselves, uh, holy men uh, in a lot of places, they use uh, marijuana to get them in a state where they're closer to God. Uh, they're spiritual. It's a, it's a spiritual thing, sir. Is this something the Indians have been doing? Uh, We've been doing this for when it's Indians were found. I mean, for so many, uh, how you want to say, moons, moons ago, way, way before. Is this something that the Indians uh, they, sh share, share with the uh, first settlers here, like, like uh, Cocorn? Yes, sir. Yes, they did. And, you know, I believe in it highly, but I also believe in the red, white, and blue. I also believe in the Indian way of life. And you can't get no better, but you can try to make it better as much as possible. And what are some of the... Uh what are some of the Indian ways of life, of the basic things that we should think about and didn't follow? Well, what you guys didn't follow years ago was uh, they they had a, their own little smoking pipe. You know, it, it's a peace pipe. They pass it around. That's a good thing. I mean, that's a damn good thing between uh, the Army, Navy, whatever that, they want, or that we went through years ago. You know, and... Uh, that's how the law got, um, how you want to say, um, a treaty. Okay. Okay. It was a treaty peace officer. That's what it was. And American people just, I don't know, for so many years, I guess they didn't understand it. They didn't help. They didn't see what the doctors saw. The doctors are seeing it more and more nowadays because of us Indians. Mm -hmm. We only try to be culture to you people, to show you what this thing can do for you. And we're not doing it to harm you or hurt you, we're doing it to help you. I know there's been probably lots of uh, Indian cures that have been lost through the, the ages. Yes, there has been. Oh, yes, there has been. If you find them. God bless you, because I mean a lot, a lot of, uh, lot of respect if you found them and you gave them back to the Indians or gave them to a doctor. But I would rather give them to an Indian tribe because they know what to do with them. Now you're uh, half Indian, correct? Yes, sir. And what tribe are you? Cherokee.